Look at this mess. So there's just camping stuff everywhere. Uh, there's a tent there. There's a hammock there. There's a rope there. There's an under blanket. There's a sleeping bag. Now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take some random things. I'm going to take um, anything but a full setup. For example, I can take the under blanket, but I can't take the hammock. I can take um, a ground sheet for the tent, but I can't take the tent. Do you know what I'm getting at? So I can't take a full setup today. I'm just going to take bits and bats of everything and just make a shelter and somehow sleep. I'm also not going to take a sleeping pad. I'm just going to exclude that just to make it more interesting. So yeah, I'm just going to take some bits and bats and, and see what sort of shelter I can make and, and sleeping setup I can make when I get there using one of everything. Let's have some fun. Yes, I'm Mr. Pussycat and welcome back to a new and very, very different kind of video. Welcome to the woods, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the woods. And tonight I've come out with a tent. No. With a hammock. No. What with? Bits and bats. I've brought a tarp. Um... A ground sheet for the Nature Height Cloud Peak 2, some pegs. Um, what else did I bring? I've got my under blanket for the hammock, but there's no hammock. Um, under blanket for the hammock, my sleeping bag, bits and bats. I'm going to make a shelter and I'm just going to sleep on the floor. No airbed, no air mattress, nothing. Talk about being at home with one, this is where it's at. So I'm basically just going to use the tarp, use the ground sheet. I don't know exactly where or how I'm going to sleep, but I'm going to make it up. I'm going to make a full sleeping setup and I'm going to make sure I'm dry. And that's the fun of this. Come into the woods and just piss about doing stuff like that. So we'll see how that ends up. But for now, we've just got a, a cheap bit of industrial tarp. We're just going to throw up. In fact, we've just started uh, here. So we're just going to throw that up and make a little area so we can chill out and watch the fire while, while being dry. This is what we live for, pussycats. This is what we live for. Woo! So we've got our little uh, man-made. That's going to be the fire pit. Got some logs and stuff here. Some goodies. We found this big tube thing, so we've cleaned it and we put some... One minute, I'll show you. Some rocks inside just to weigh it down. There's Cozzy Bear's... Big bag, he's got his tent. Like I say, I haven't got a shelter, so I'm gonna make something between these two and just sleep here somewhere. So I'm gonna start cracking on and making some sort of livable area now. Woohoo! So the first thing I'm gonna do is sort my shelter out. That's gonna be the tarp. So obviously it's gonna be raining tonight. It is actually raining all night, you know. Is that, uh, yeah. So, uh, We'll get this nice and low, because I'm going to be on the floor somewhere. Right, go, stand on that. <laughs> well, that'll be a bit high actually. About there, I reckon. There we are. That's a shelter, there's a roof. Set up. So now. We've just got a beer each cracked open here, me and Cosmeister. But I'm thinking of using this next, which is my uh, ground sheet for the Nature Height Cloud Peak 2. So I'm thinking of pegging that down underneath. And going from there, really. No plan. Nature Height Cloud Peak 2 ground sheet on the deck. Shifted a few big like sticks and stuff. That's just on the deck. So next in line, I'm thinking maybe the hammock under blanket. Um, yeah, hammock under blanket on top, as I've got no sleeping pad. Followed by sleeping bag and pillar. Let's have a deke. Under blanket. Tell you what, guys, I'm quite happy with this. So we've got my tarp, 
Sea to uh, Sea to Summit. Nature Hike Cloud Peak to Under Blank uh, Ground Sheet. The Snug Pack Hammock Under Blanket. The OEX Sleeping Bag. The Trichology Pillar. <laughs> and the little light up there from Amazon. Talk about bits and bats and making a camp. Down here, got that to keep me warm later. I had it on in my last video. Good uh, summit camp with the boys on the last one. Power bank. And if you know, you know. But that is where it's at. And it is a cosy camp because I've got my set up here next to me. The Cosmeister's there in the beautiful, spectacular MSR Hubba Hubba. It wasn't my first tent, but it was my first tent which I put any kind of money into. And it served me really, really well. It's a fantastic tent. That ain't yours though. No, that ain't mine, no. <laughs> no, that's Cozzy's. I had the uh, the same tent. Should have made that a bit clearer, should I? But that's us tonight, guys. And we're just gonna be by the fire here under this man-made shelter that we've made. Should be a good one. Should be a belter. I'm quite impressed with that. <laughs> Until I wake up freezing my bollocks off. <laughs> Two in the morning. But yeah. Should stay dry. Should stay warm. The under blanket's warm. I can also wrap that round me a bit if needs be. The sleeping bag's comfort rating of minus one. Should be okay. It should be okay. Let's really put the word should in capital letters. So now we're just going to chill out, have a couple of beers, get the fire going soon before we're getting some scrunk go and whatnot. And yes, I. I am good at wild camping. I'm proper good at wild camping. And attached to my shelter here. Look at that. I love it, mate, with that. Uh, but attached to my shelter. Bit of string. We we'll believe no trace bag. So we'll fill that bag up nicely, I reckon. Oh yeah. Get the fire started. A fire starter. We have full permission to be here, full permission to have fires. We will still leave no trace, obviously, at the end. But yeah, that's why we're having a fire, guys, because we are allowed to. So brop, 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 brop. Skinny pop, pop, pop. Brop. Not better though, is it? No, it's not an old. I forgot my cup, but luckily Cosatron's got skills, so he's made a cup out of a Northern Monk can, which I've obviously finished. So, I know you. Mr. A's Outdoors, you know, I watch your channel, you're a good guy, you're a legend, and I know your face is all over cans and that, but have you ever made a cup out of a can? Eh? Think you're hard, do you? Eh? <laughs> no, you've got a good channel, mate, and um, you got more people that watch yours and watch mine, so you're winning, aren't you? End it, day with all your money. Another Monk Cup, yes, I. Now it's going well, we're starting to lose light a little bit. Fire's going strong. We've collected plenty of wood. Got loads to last us. This shelter here, I just can't get my head around it. <laughs> it's, uh, I've never ever camped like this before, ever. It's proper, could go one way or other, do you know what I mean? But yeah, we've got plenty of wood here, guys, and fire's lovely, so night's going well. We're having a good chat, me and the Cosmeister, the Cosmi Bear, the Cosatron. All is good in the hood. Speaking of hoods, got this bad boy on again. I'd be lost about it. So, yet again, big thank you, Mooster. Keep it real with Ian Beal. Dot cotton, get your rat out. Look at this, guys. We've made a little wall. Well, a big wall. Made a wall now to stop the uh, the embers are flying towards the Cosmeister's tent. So, we've made this wall out the tarp. So, we've got this full shelter in a wall now. It's like making dens. Look at this. Oh, yes. Look at that. And I'm over here. Luckily, I'm... I'm out of way of all embers flying at me, so I'm quite lucky. But this is what dreams are made of. This is a Kushtibari Charvachur 
little living room we've got going on now. We've got the wall up as well. This is where it's at, baby. Living in the woods. Living in the woods. Adam in the woods. Adam in the wild. Adam in the woods. Adam in the wild. Adam in the woods. Look at this, guys. Look at this view from my uh, made shelter. Time for a bit of flame grilled steakatron. Oh yeah. That's how we do it guys. Look at that. That is the future. So it's gonna chill out for the rest of the night and we'll call it a day very soon. So I'll see you guys in the morning. Yes I am Mr Pussycat. Don't mean to brag, but I am proper good at wild camping. Yes, I put a cat. Sleep at the wheel, going faster. The days are just flying on by. There's nothing to gain from living in pain. I'm dizzy and aching inside. Sleep at the wheel going faster I just can't take any more Good morning from my uh, little thing. I was warm all night, not the most uncomfortable. I slept. First time I woke up was like four o'clock. So I can't argue with that. It is a bit cold, but I am outside of the sleeping bag now. Got my legs hanging out and that, so but lovely and toasty warm inside. I'm shaking here. So uh we'll get up, get sorted before we head off. And uh, live the dream. So hold tight. This is where it's at. Right here. Right here. Timed it just right, look at me hat. Timed it just right. Rain started coming down big time. So I was gonna make his way out the woods now. And uh, get our bums home. That's where camp was. Big shout out to Greg. Who let us stay here again. You can find this woodland on the old tinter web. Hainsworth Woods. Wait a minute, you might witness first hand me falling over big time here. Yeah? I think he's got a Facebook page as well. And you can come stay here if you want to. Uh, I think he charges a fiver. And it's uh, it's not like a proper no reception desk or all like that. It's a good woodland. Struggling up this hill here. Thanks for watching. And yes, I, Mr. Pussycats. <laughs>